Do you hear the I Love Lucy? Da 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 so sorry, I've been watching I Love Lucy reruns all day if you hear talking in the background. But what is up you guys? Now this video might seem a little crazy, but as you guys know, I am a reborn bookworm. I was a bookworm as a kid and then just got busy. I'm basically booktube at this point. My Instagram is all book recommendations. If you're not following me on Instagram, make sure you go do that. And a lot of you message me like, how are you reading so fast? And I don't have an answer for that. I don't really know. I just can't really put a book down if I really like it. Ew, I just realized I have hair conditioner all up under my fingernails. So I saw some videos on YouTube of people, you know, reading as many books as they can in 24 hours. I was like, I'm gonna do that. Loki? You just want to be the main character always. Wanna say hi? He's so big now. He's like 17 pounds. You're just a big boy. You're just the biggest. So yeah, I'm gonna try and read as many books as I can in a day. I don't know which I'm gonna start with, but I have so many books that I bought. It is currently 5.49. So yeah, we're just gonna get right into this. I think my dog is broken. <laughs> Sir? Sir? My guy, that's your tail. It's your tail. All right, book number one, November 9th, Colleen Hoover. Y'all already know, I've seen this everywhere. I don't know what it's about. I read Ugly Love, I read It Ends With Us. I pre-ordered It Starts With Us, so I will probably cry. All right, so it's been about two hours. I'm 100 pages in. I can't put it down, I can already tell. I will be crying, so I should probably grab my tissues. I also need to order dinner. Um, I should probably eat. Just wanted to update you guys. All right, you guys, so I got some pizza. And to keep me awake, good old Mountain Dew. As you guys know, I don't really drink coffee. You know, I'm gonna have to be up pretty late reading, so I might regret this. So I'm I'm crying. Not even to the end. Oh gosh, if this is I'm mid I'm halfway kind of. Just wanted to update you. Alright, so it is 1030 and I'm at 200 pages. I think this book is like 300 something. I've already been heartbroken and then like not heartbroken and then like heartbroken again. All right, so it's 12.24, I just finished. This was crazy. I wish I was recording when this book like takes a turn because like I was not expecting that. I'm usually someone who can kind of like guess what's gonna happen, but this, like my jaw was like dropped. I, that's just not how I thought that was gonna go. Definitely would read the triggers before reading this book. Okay, um, I'm gonna take a little break and then just read until like, I literally can't keep my eyes open anymore, so. All right, so it's 12.45. I'm pretty awake because of the Mountain Dew. So the next book is The Song of Achilles. I've seen really good things about this online, so I'm hoping it's good. So it is three in the morning. I'm a little past 100 pages. I can't put it down. I thought this book was gonna start kind of slow because all I knew about it was like obviously Greek mythology, but it is so good, not what I thought. I'm probably gonna read a little more and head to bed. <clears throat> morning, it's eight in the morning. I feel crazy. I went to bed around like four because the book just got so good. I had the weirdest dream that Ayla and I we're on a plane. Out of nowhere. We had to make an emergency landing in the ocean. It was weird. Okay. Anyways, I'm gonna get up. Good morning, sleepy. You want some food? <gasps> it's 9:30. I'm pretty sleepy. I keep like dozing in and out. I'm gonna start reading like this at this point. I'm basically on page 200. So yeah. All right. So it's 1:20. I just finished. This was very different from what I usually read, but it was so good. If you like Greek mythology, this is like a cool twist. So I need to eat some lunch. I'll probably go visit Crawford, pick either one or two more books. So okay, yeah. I took a little break and I came to Crawford's, but the next book is Riverbend Gap. 
I don't know anything about it. This is the series, the first one of this series. All right, it's 2.33. My goal is to have this finished by 5.45, maybe six, because Croft and I have a thing that we have to go do later, so. How you doing? Smoking's really good. Which is better, the sub or the book? <laughs> oh, both are really good. It's so hard not to fall asleep. Crawford's gonna take over for me. Okay, go. Well. All right, were you protective big brothers? First, we just kind of ignored her, but then this punk started giving her trouble, and we set him, set him straight. I can't read. <laughs> he only told him she had foster parents. Okay. okay. Cooper actually okay, okay, knew more about okay, the past than okay, Gavin did. Okay, give me. Been there you know, give it. What? Give it. I'm helping. <laughs> Guys, I've dozed off. How many times have I dozed off now? Like 15. 15 times? Like three. Yeah, I've dozed off like three times. Okay. I'm drinking a Red Bull, but you can see it in my eyes. Like My body is just like... <laughs> Please sleep. All right guys, so I fell asleep. I'm not gonna lie to you. I think it's like 5.50 something, but I'm so tired. I probably shouldn't have stayed up till 4 a.m. But um, this book is so good. Crawford and I have to get ready because we're going to an event. And so I'm just gonna have to pick this up when I get back. All right guys, update. So it's the next day. I just finished Riverbend Gas. This took me about five and a half hours. So just like an overall kind of update. November 9th took me about six hours. Achilles took me about seven and a half hours. Um, so in total, I'm at like 19. So I have five hours left to complete the 24. So I'm gonna pick, I'm gonna pick, I'm gonna pick another book <laughs> to read. Um, obviously this isn't like a book review video, but I really like this one. Um, also the next book in this series literally came out last month. So that couldn't be more perfect because I did not want to wait. It's called Mulberry Hollow. I'm reading about like 50 to 60 pages, it seems like on average. So yeah, I don't know if that's like fast or average. I don't know, let me know how fast it takes you guys. Oh my God, my baby's calling. Hello? I'm filming. My book video, I just finished. Book number three. Oh, so you're a booktuber? I am, I'm a booktuber now. Oh yeah, bye, I love you. So yeah, I'm gonna pick one more book. Oh yeah, I'm gonna pick one of my new ones because I have a full stack. All right, I picked the next book. It is The Lost Apothecary. I have no idea what this is about, but I was seeing it everywhere that I was buying books and I know it's a bestseller, I think. Let's see how this goes. All right, so I'm done. It took about five hours and 20 minutes. Yeah, so that puts us at, drum roll please. Four books. We got to four books in 24 hours, 1300 pages. I did the math. I don't know if I could have done more. But yeah, let me know if you guys would like to see like a 24 hours straight video. That would probably consist of a lot of Mountain Dew and no sleep. So yeah, four books. I will include these in my next book you need to read video. So stay tuned. But yeah, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. If you enjoyed it, comment down below any book recs you have for me. You guys gave me so many in the last video, so thank you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, join the family, and I love ya. We're doing great, and I'll see you guys next time. Okay, bye!